The idea and concept of intellectual property rights protection has always been associated with Talal Abu Ghazali. He is recognized as one of the most influential leaders globally with lifetime achievements, distinctions, and outstanding contributions to education, intellectual property, law, accountancy, business administration, and many other fields. Your Excellency, it's a great pleasure to have you with the Ajib editorial team to launch its new website and for giving us the chance to explore the global IP scene with you. In two years, Ajib will become 50 years old. During this period, it's received many global accolades, in particular being awarded top IP firm in the Middle East by managing intellectual property, MIP, for 10 consecutive years. How do you describe this journey and what is the key factor that made this journey such a success story? I think this last statement uh, you made, the last sentence in your statement, summarizes it all. It's the quality of our services that made us what we are. And the quality of our services is the result of the efforts of our team. We take pride in having the best team you can have, dedicated, fully accomplished and experienced and knowledgeable operators in the field of intellectual property. When I started this firm, particularly in this part of the world, intellectual property was something that is coming from the moon. Nobody understood it. And our first mission, the first part of our mission was to create an awareness and an understanding about the importance of intellectual property. Intellectual property is not to protect the rights of the owners only. It is through that protection, it is the tool for economic development. It is the tool to enforce more regulation so that you get more inventions. It is, as uh, Franklin Roosevelt called it, uh, intellectual property added fire, as it added flame or, or oil to the fire of genius. Genius needs intellectual property to get inflamed. To, uh, so what we're doing, uh, my belief in intellectual property as a mission made us a success. And I always tell my, our young generations all over the world, in order to succeed, you must have a mission. Realizing that intellectual property is the economic driver made me believe that uh, it should be my mission. And I want to, s to give credit where it's due. The first time I heard about intellectual property was at a conference in San Francisco by Time Warner, and I, intellectual property, what does that mean? And I then started like a good student, which is, which is what I am until now, I started learning about intellectual property. And then I decided to join the wonderful group of intellectual property operators, operating firms, whether they are owners of intellectual property, offices or agents for intellectual property registration. This wonderful, wonderful community I came to know inspired me and the, as a good student of the world global community, I decided that we want to add to this wonderful group another firm that combines intellectual property with information technology. I am an IT person and I wanted to to create a firm that is an IT firm which provides intellectual property services. So our clients now have the privilege of operating with the firm which is completely digital and we, through the, the fact that we use digital technology, we can cut the time between these time zone differences, the weekends, the languages, everything. This is how we became what we became, and I owe it to the 
school I learned, in which I learned intellectual property, which is the community of intellectual property companies and firms to whom I owe my allegiance, my respect, and my love. And I owe to them what I learned and what I'm doing today. I learned from every one of them, and I developed friendships with so many of these wonderful people that I enjoyed working with, and I enjoy, and I will enjoy, as a firm, as one of the leading firms of the world, we are very proud to belong to the IP community.